Hey guys, welcome back. I'm Divinely Destined. Hey Virgo, how you doing? Good. I'm going to give you a quick message, Virgo. This is going to be a general message, love. Now remember, this is for you, Virgo, if you have your sun, your Venus, your rising, and the sign of Virgo. Cross watchers are welcome, okay? It's going to be a quick message, Virgo. But it's also a general message, so love, it may or may not resonate with you. Okay, we're going to go ahead and see what spirit has for you, Virgo. For the sign of Virgo. Virgo. Woo, power. Power coming out, Virgo. You're very powerful. Virgo is Virgo to God, okay? Virgos are the body. Virgos represents the bodies. Virgo represents the bank. Virgo represents spiritual and magical abilities. Virgo is powerful, okay? I see that you have power. Wow. You may be a witch for Halloween, okay? You may have a witch's hat that you're going to plan on wearing at a uh, Halloween event this year, Virgo. Okay? But yeah, we have power coming out. You may have long brown hair. You may have long dark hair, Virgo. You may be connecting to past loved ones, ancestors, spirit guides, okay? You may have a powerful ability to connect to the spiritual world, Virgo, okay? I feel like you have a spiritual, uh, spiritual calling, and I also feel like you have a powerful ability to connect to past loved ones, ancestors, spirit guides, but also people that have passed on. You are able to connect, Virgo. We have divine feminine energy coming out. Look how stunning you are. You're beautiful, okay? You're in your divine feminine power. Yes, this is a beautiful message, and it's, it's going to be a quick message for the sign of Virgo, but wow, it's beautiful, okay? You may be tall. You don't have to be, but there's a lot of stars around you, Virgo. You may be um, connected to someone that's uh, popular or famous. You may be popular or famous, Virgo. You may be well-known, but also with the stars, you're destined for something here. You're destined for something very great and very powerful, you may already be living out your calling, or you may spirit may be calling you to start living out your blessings and out your callings here. I'm hearing you may be spirit is calling you to start living out your destiny. There we go. You may work in the legal field, Virgo. You may be in the justice field. Okay. The stars are all I'm I'm also hearing the stars are all aligned for you, Virgo. Oh wow. Beautiful. We're gonna take a few more. Once again, this is not gonna be a long reading, Virgo. But I definitely wanted to give my Virgos a reading today because I am a Virgo and I haven't done a Virgo reading in a while. So it was time, okay? So overall, Virgo, you're very powerful, okay? You, you have the ability to connect. You have the ability to connect to past loved ones, ancestors, spirit guides. You also have the ability to connect with people that have passed on, okay? They may be trying to communicate. People that have passed on may need to use you as a, um, a medium to help them cross over. I'm hearing Virgo. Yes, you're very beautiful too. You may love the color pink. I'm hearing a lot of eyes are on you, so there may be a lot of people watching you and watching you come up and watching you shine, okay? There may be a lot of people that's trying to get, it, get, in, get in this spotlight with you, Virgo. Wow. Summer. The summer tower, okay? You may have a beautiful farmhouse, I'm hearing, Virgo. Virgo, you may have a beautiful garden. You may like to plant sunflowers. You may like to receive sunflowers. I'm also hearing that there are some Virgos that may like to receive, like, a flower in a vase, and they have it, um... On their bedside table here you may be very sexually um feeling it right now going into this fall season okay you may be very sexually excited today or going into the fall virgo prosperity wow beautiful yes your destiny is calling and it's going to lead you to a lot of money virgo but this is indicating you're very prosperous already on your own okay you're a very prosperous person you're a very powerful prosperous feminine woman watching this now, if you're a male Virgo watching this, take the roles how they resonate, okay? You are a powerful, sophisticated, strong Virgo male, okay? Take it how it resonates, okay? You're, oh, I'm also seeing and I'm also hearing that your past loved ones may be trying to connect you to some money, Virgo. Yes, pay attention to your dreams, okay? Pay attention to everything because I'm feeling like... Your ancestors are trying to guide you to some money or some, some, some kind of property here or some type, of, some type of asset, okay, that's very lucrative, that's very beneficial and very financially rewarding, financially rewarding for you, Virgo. Your spirit guide, your ancestors, your past loved ones is trying to connect you to this, okay? Use your abilities and your power to, to uh, pay attention to the things that they're trying to tell you and alert you to, okay? I'm hearing your dad and your mom may be in heaven, Okay? Fertility, beautiful. 
beautiful. They may be trying to connect you to a person that uh, is your perfect match. You may be undergoing fertility treatments. You may be connected to a Libra because Libra had this card as well. Okay, you may be coming into union with a Libra. There's a lot of angelic presence in this reading as well, Virgo. Wow, most certainly I feel like we have some Virgos that's very connected to Libras. Okay, your spirit guys, your angels, your ancestors, your past loved ones may be trying to connect you to your spiritual partner, your counterpart, your soulmate, your twin flame. You may already be in a very fertile relationship and you guys may be getting ready to conceive a child. You may be getting ready to conceive a child with a Libra. You may have a child with a Libra. You may have a Libra child, Virgo, I'm hearing. Wow, but you're very powerful. This this gift that you have to be able to connect to the other world, I call it the other world, okay? The spiritual world, Virgo. The abilities that you have to be able to connect to the spiritual world is going to gain you. They're going to lead you right to a prosperity, prosperity okay? It's going to lead you to an abundant amount of finances. I feel like you're going to be able to, um, I'm here to take control of your life. Okay, once you get your finances in order. Now, there's a lot of Virgos that may be watching that are financially abundant. Once again, this could indicate that your spirit guides, ancestors, loved ones may be trying to connect you to your spiritual counterpart, your soulmate, the one that's destined to be with you, Virgo. Okay? Yes. <clears throat> this person, your, sp your spiritual counterpart, your twin flame, your divine masculine loves your beauty. Okay? He loves you. He sees you as a star. You may be in a public eye. Okay, Virgo, I'm hearing you may be in a public eye. He notices this. He watches this. He knows who you are. I'm feeling like you guys are going to get this beautiful house. Okay? You, just, you, you got three different ways that your angels, spirit guides, loved ones in heaven are trying to connect to you. And they're trying to manifest, help you manifest this money, this prosperity. It's not all about money. Prosperity doesn't always indicate or is indicative of money. Okay? This could indicate love. You may be designed, you may be destined to bring a baby into the world with someone, Virgo. And I'm hearing Libra once again, okay? Wow, and I'm also hearing same sex, okay? You may be connected to a same sex uh, partner here, Virgo. But yes, most certainly your spirit guides, your past loved ones, your ancestors are trying to connect you to some prosperity here. This could indicate um, a spiritual union, a spiritual union coming into fruition. This could also indicate you being into a new home, okay? I'm, I'm seeing a house here. Okay, wow, you're very powerful, and you gained your spiritual gu uh, guidance, and you, you gained your spiritual knowledge from past ancestors, Virgo. Of course, God gives us gifts, okay, God gives you the gift, okay, but you also, and God gives us things that we inherit, we inherit from ancestors, and you inherited amazing, powerful spiritual gifts from your ancestors, Virgo. Look, <laughs> need any more indication? We got healer. Not only are you a powerful manifester and your spirit guides and ancestors and angels are trying to help you manifest prosperity, Virgo. Now you take prosperity for what it means for you. But they're also letting you know that you have powerful healing abilities, Virgo. You have the power to heal the masses, I'm hearing. Oh my God, what a beautiful short reading for the sign of Virgo. And you see, if you see a lot of flashes going on, Virgo, that's a lot of angelic presence in this reading, okay? Wow, this is this is a beautiful message for you, Virgo. Whew, you all, you guys are awesome, Virgo, and most certainly, you have you're a powerful healer, Virgo. You're a powerful healer here. You're a powerful healer. You have gifts that other people, mere humans, uh, could never have. Okay, <laughs> you're very powerful here. You have a powerful calling on your life, and you have the power. You have a powerful ability to heal. And your ancestors want you to know that there are healing situations in your life for you as we speak. Okay, that's the message for you, Virgo. Things have may, things may have not been going as well as you hope lately. Okay, but your angels, your ancestors, your spirit guides want you to know that things are going to get better, Virgo. Okay, things are getting better for you. And they want you to know that they're with you. They're with you. And they're actually helping you manifest your abilities. Okay, yeah, most certainly I'm dealing with some Virgos that are uh, healers. Okay, you, you, you have all the clear audience, clear sensing, clear knowing. You have magical special powers, Virgo. Virgo, they're watching you, your angels, your ancestors, your, your spirit guides, your ancestors. Okay, they come in all shapes and sizes and they come to protect and watch over you. All the days of your life, this, these ancestors will, will watch over you, Virgo. We're going to take some final messages for the sign of Virgo. Arch Archangel Michael. Let me get one more message for the sign of Virgo. Okay, I got three, so we're going to try to take it here. Virgo, Spirit is saying don't let fear, insecurity, doubt, or feeling, like, don't let your anxiety get the best of you here. 
Yeah, you may be manifesting a child. I told you there was a child that may be getting ready to be born out of the spiritual union that your ancestors and past loved ones are trying to get you to connect with, Virgo. Wow.